worth falling for Oh, and with open arms I'll carry you Hi, good morning, Rebecca, 13 with Rebecca. I have a little bit of time, so I'm going to, uh, just a little, uh, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you some of the things I got from my garage sale hauls over the weekend, over this weekend and over last weekend. I didn't do one last week, so so some of that stuff that I got last week has already sold off in um, auctions, so I'm going to show you what I had left from there and what I still have and what I got recent, recently. And I know there's more. I'm just not seeing it in my head right now. I can't find my my stick to hold the camera. So, well, here we go. All right. I'm going to show you and turn you around. Okay. So, I got this pretty great. It's a Jim Beam decanter. It does look like Empoli, but I'm pretty. Oh, it's fine. It is not. It is a Jim Beam one. And then I got this pair of these ones that say Jafra, Je, Je, Or maybe it's the other way around. I don't know. But they're really nice. I got this Fastoria vase. This little, um, little cute guy planter <laughs> with little babies. Carrying the babies with the basket in his mouth. Her mouth. All right. And then... This is also Fastoria Candy Dish. This is a Prince's House Tumble Up. This is one of those, you know, Japan. I'm, I'm going to look it up. I haven't looked it up. Sorry. Um, Murano uh, Controlled Bubble Bowl Ashtray. These three elephant foot vases. This pair of uh, bookends. They, they look almost like cake pieces to me, but I'm not sure. I got all these paperweights. Um, I had... At least five or six more, and they sold in a whatnot auction the night that I got them. I got this very pretty Jack in the Pulpit vase. This also super pretty, super cute black amethyst smoky gray vase. Uh, these are two sets of coasters. They're both art glass coasters. These are purple, and these are more reddish. I got all these flowers which I'll sell in a lot. And then the um, another paperweight, the starfish paperweight. I guess I should put him by them. And uh, I got all of this uranium glass glasses for five bucks. So, and then this, of course, is one of my faves. It's a whale, and I believe it's a vase because of the tail, the way the tail is. I think it's a vase, not a paperweight. Um... I feel like I'm missing things, but uh, I I don't know where I put them. On. <laughs> so, um, yeah, that this was some of the good stuff. You know, I did get more, but I sold it before I even got to <laughs> put it up. So, uh, I just wanted to show you some things that um, uh, I'm doing an Instagram live sale tonight with Thirty Cents Five and Kick Ass Glass from the Past on Instagram. And then tomorrow night, I will do a whatnot auction. I was going to do a whatnot auction last night, but Crazy Lamp Lady was doing one, so I kind of didn't see the point in going on. But um, so this is what's going to be some of what will be in tonight's uh, sale on Instagram. And uh, yeah, so I spent... Uh, hold on one second. Yeah, so I spent all weekend doing this, going to garage sales, being exhausted, being... You know, just doing things. And uh, uh, I I had yesterday, my daughter brought her dog. We're keeping him for a week again. So there's that. Um, I Oh, and yesterday I also, yesterday I spent all day um, packing. I had to pack up all the stuff that I had sold and whatnot. And then all the stuff and the stuff I had sold in Instagram. Sorry, I'm trying to find a full phone holder. Oh. Hold on one second. I'll be right back. So, so yeah, I spent yesterday, there's a whole batch over here of whatnot that has labels on it. And then the whole batch over there is from Instagram. 
which um, I got to print out the labels at work and then I'd put them on them and get them out. And then I would have everything out. There would be nothing, nothing left. Oh, I also, I got this pair of vintage uh, cruet. Uh, those would be also in the sale. And then these three little guys, which is a little baby piano, a Cinderella carriage, and then a basket with, I believe, lucite grapes is supposed to be in there. And I feel like something else over here that I'm not seeing, but, oh, and then also this Talavera guy, this is a resting spoon, or a, you know, spoon holder. Um, that's not what it's called, but anyway, so it, I did, I had a great whatnot sale the other day. I did, um, I feel like the camera is pointing up or something. I don't know. Anyway, I did a sale with where I, at first it was just regular stuff, but then I had went to garage sales and I went to this garage sale based on a picture one of the lady had put in her, uh, Facebook post that I saw the whale. And I couldn't tell if it was glass or anything. I just wanted to see. So I went there and it was the whale. And it was a box full of paperweights and art glass flowers. And she just was like, I just need to get rid of them. Whatever you want to pay is what we'll pay. And she charged me like a dollar each item. And it, it was fantastic. I got a whole box of art glass. And then I posted the picture of them. And then um, did a one-night auction that night. And a good amount of people came, but um, shout out to King Genzo 27. He bought a lot of it. He bought that amethyst uh, glass vase that had the four glass flowers in it for a hundred bucks. That was great. Um, yeah, it, it was a great sale. I, I did really well. I, I sold a good amount of stuff and made a good amount of money. So I'm trying, I, I'm trying to balance doing between whatnot and Instagram. Like I, I, um, I'm trying to do what now when not the big, huge, uh, sellers are on because, you know, they take up all the air in the room and they, <coughs> um, you know, if people go and spend all the money in there, then they're not gonna have any money to spend in yours. So, um, I try to do it on the days they're not on, um, and then I do Instagram on those other days. Like on the days where I do whatnot, I do, I mean, on the days I don't do whatnot, I do Instagram. So, yeah, so, but that's been working out for me. I, I like it. I like um, doing it, you know, one than the other, not just one all the time. So, um, yeah, I'm going to do a sale tonight and hopefully it will go well and or at least i'll sell a few items is fine just to move something you know i'm not buying all this stuff and spending all this time so that i can just have it here <laughs> i need people to want it and take it away and take it to their house and uh so yeah that's what i'm gonna do uh i gotta get ready for uh, i gotta get ready to go um it's almost time for me to be at work um but I'm going to do a little video. I didn't, I didn't film. Um, I mean, lately it's hard. It's difficult. The garage sales are more difficult to, because a lot of garage sales, you're in there for like 30 seconds. You, you know, you you know, the time it takes you to sit there and get your camera going and you can already, you probably already eyed whether there's things for you or not. And um, it takes you that quick to go through it and you're back in the car and having to do, you know, reset it. And it, it, it's just, it's a, it's a, it's not as easy as um, Goodwills and stuff like that because you're just in one place. You can just rent, you can film nonstop and, and where garage sales is in and out, in and out. And it just takes a lot of time, you know, and often you only get one item from there. You know, I wish I would have been filming that day of the, <laughs> where she had the paperweights, but I didn't. Cause that was a morning before I was going to work and I have a limited amount of time to work, to get, go in these garage sales before I got to be to work. So I don't have time to do that. I have to be going. I have to jump in and out of the car, get what I'm going to get and get back in and go to the next and to, you know, to, to, to do what I'm trying to do. So I apologize for that. I will, but I will try. Garage sale season, I mean, 
this weekend there was a whole lot of garage sales and it but it was so hot it was so hard to even do anything because of the heat um i started to feel sick around 12 30 and i decided to go home because it was just too hot the air in my car wasn't working right and it was i don't know so anyway i hope you have a blessed day i hope you have a great day and i will see you tomorrow I tried to run and hide, but you were by my side I can remember thinking you were crazy love, but I don't mind You wouldn't let me go, you let me take it slow And now my heart is changing, I've been thinking, baby I wanna love you better Worth falling for Oh, and with open arms I'll carry you